You said you feel like Joe Biden is dividing the country, but do you feel like Donald Trump is doing the same by falsely telling people that he won that election when he lost it? How does that divide the country? Questioning, questioning an election where there are obviously problems is, is dividing the country? Since when can we not ask questions about our elections? As a journalist for many years, I was a journalist after 2016, and I distinctly remember many people just like you asking a lot of questions about the 2016 election results. And nobody tried to shut you up. Nobody tried to tell Hillary Clinton to shut up. Nobody tried to tell Kamala Harris when she was questioning the uh, legitimacy of these electronic voting machines to stop. We're, we have freedom of speech in this country, and you of all people should appreciate that. You're supposedly a journalist. You should appreciate that. So I don't see how asking questions about an election where there are many problems is dividing a country. What I do see dividing a country is shutting people down, censoring people, canceling people, trying to destroy people's lives when they do ask questions. Last I heard, we still have the Constitution. It's hanging by a thread, thanks to some of the work some people in this area have done. But we're going to save that Constitution, and we're going to bring back freedom of speech. And maybe someday you'll thank us for that. Gary, what questions are you asking about the election, Did you have a question, though? Sir? Like you, you keep saying that it's Did, been I'm not stolen. answering you. Did you have a question, sir? Why won't you answer my question? Did you have a question, sir? Or not? Well, if I, you don't I, have I, one. I, I do, but I'm, I'm interested in the answer to this. I'm not interested, I mean, in, I'm, I'm not interested in taking her question. Sir, are you afraid to answer Joe Biden's question? These people are on to it. These people are on to the fact that our local paper is a rag for the Democrat Party, that our local paper is, is hell-bent on running attack pieces on an American citizen in Arizona who wants to stand up and do right. And they're tired of it. That's why they're not, they don't even line the birdcage with it anymore. It's that bad.